Forget blood sugar and cholesterol for a moment. There's a silent puppet master in your body that your doctor likely never checks. Cortisol. When balanced, it's your friend, helping you sleep deep and stay calm. But when it's chronically high, it's a wrecking ball. It scrambles your other hormones, prematurely ages your brain, and directs your body to store stubborn fat. You might be accidentally spiking it every single day. Here are seven sneaky habits that keep your cortisol locked in the danger zone. Thinking longer runs equals better health. You might be triggering your body's primal fight or flight alarm, the HPA axis, nonstop. Without adequate rest, your nervous system never gets the signal to relax. Chronic cardio can become chronic stress. Three times a week is often plenty. You think it's just about indigestion or calories? That late night bite does a triple whammy. It suppresses melatonin, delays deep sleep, and can spike your cortisol right by morning, setting you up for a stressful day. Without bright, natural light, your brain loses its cue to lower cortisol in the evening. It stays elevated when it should be falling. The result? Disrupted sleep, low mood, and a nervous system stuck on alert. Chronic people-pleasing equals a perpetually activated nervous system. Every yes you didn't mean to say can trigger a low-grade stress response, overstimulating your HPA axis and trapping you in a cycle of silent stress. Your brain isn't designed for six browser tabs, three chats, and two deadlines. Constant task switching floods your system with cortisol, shatters focus, and weakens memory. You feel busy, but your nervous system is begging for a break. Every notification, every ding and buzz is a micro-stressor. It hijacks your attention, provides a hit of distracting dopamine, and forces your body to release cortisol. Your focus breaks, and anxiety creeps in. Doom scrolling, intense movies, or stressful conversations before bed? Your nervous system can't tell the difference between this and real danger. It keeps the cortisol faucet dripping, preventing true recovery. When cortisol stays high for too long, it can literally rewire your brain's pain pathways, creating chronic pain out of thin air. This is why so many people chase physical fixes, massages, injections, even surgery, while the real culprit is a nervous system stuck in permanent survival mode.